To find the area of any regular polygon, multiplying one half by the apothem of our polygon by the perimeter of our regular polygon will give us the area of our regular polygon. We are going to use the example of a regular hexagon to demonstrate how to use this area formula. The first thing we have to do is figure out what the length of the hexagon's apothem is. The apothem in this case is 7 inches. The apothem is the distance from the center of your polygon to the midpoint of any of the polygon sides. Next, we have to figure out what the perimeter of our regular hexagon is. Because a regular hexagon has six sides that are equal in length, and we already know that one of our sides is 8 inches, all we have to do is multiply 6 by 8, which would give us a perimeter of 48 inches. After substituting the length of your apothem and the perimeter of your regular polygon into your formula, multiply those two numbers together. In this case, that product would give us 336. Now we have to figure out what one half of 336 is. Multiplying any number by one half is the same thing as dividing that number by two. So we are going to take 336 and divide that number by 2 and that will give us the area of our regular hexagon. We can fit two groups of 16 into 33, which would give us 32. The difference of 33 and 32 is 1. Now we have to bring down our next place value and that is a 6. And we can fit exactly 8 groups of 2 into 16. Now we know that the area of our regular hexagon is equal to 168 square inches. Now we are going to demonstrate how to use this formula using a regular octagon. The first thing we have to do is figure out what the length of the apothem is of our regular octagon, and we can see that the apothem is 6 inches. So we have to multiply 1 half by 6 by the perimeter of our octagon. We can see that each side length of our octagon is 5 inches and because we have 8 sides equal in length, we can multiply 8 times 5 and that would give us a perimeter of 40 inches. The next thing that we can do is multiply 6 by 40 which is 240. So after we figure out what 1 half of 240 is, that will give us the area of our regular octagon. You can ignore the zero and just cut 24 in half, which would be 12, and then add that zero back. So the area of our regular octagon is equal to 120 square inches.